the UNDP that is the United Nations Development Program uh, recently published its annual HDI index that is Human Development Index uh, and it was for the year 2021-2022. The results however were, were not very good and to be honest that is to be expected. If you see the graph on your screen you will see that the global HDI score has fallen consecutively for the last two years that is 2020 and 2021 which is scary and this is the first time in the last 32 years that the worldwide uh, HDI score has fallen consecutively for two years even though it was projected to go up in uh, in the last annual year. Uh, the reasons have been mentioned as obviously the COVID-19 pandemic, the geopolitical tussle in the tussles in the world such as the, the crisis in Ukraine, the crisis in Afghanistan, so on and so forth. However, uh, when we see uh, the condition of India, India has also slipped a rank from 131st to 132nd, which is also scary. But there are some questions that we need to ask as to what is the Human Development Index, how is development measured, and uh, what does it show? And we are going we are we are going to ta tackle these questions in this video today. My name is Ishan Fazdar, and you are watching the Upfront. I have talked about many indices on this channel such as the Asia Power Index, uh, the Inequality Index, the Happiness Index, so on and so forth. So we all already understand that, the in, that an index measures something, some aspect of development or some aspect of the country. Similarly, the Human Development Index measured the, measures the multidimensional development of a country, multidimensional development of humans. Uh, similarly, as is done by the Niti Aayog in its recently developed Multidimensional Poverty Index. Uh, which I talked about in a previous video. The HDI, that is the Human Development Index, was developed in 1990 by two by two econ economists, uh, the Pakistani economist Mahbubul Haq and the Indian Nobel laureate Amartya Sen. Subsequently, UNDP, that is the United Nations Development Program, took it upon itself to publish an annual HDI report uh, every year. However, a central question still stands that how does the UNDP manage to measure something as subjective and as complex as development. Now, there are three components that goes into developing uh, that is going to me measuring the human development index. The first is the knowledge standard of a country. The second is the uh, health standard of the country and the third is the uh, standard of living. To measure the knowledge standard of a country there are two measures which there are two indicators. The first is the expected schooling of a child and the second is the mean the mean schooling of a child uh, obviously this means that uh, uh, these two numbers are the approximate data of how many years a child is getting education from how many uh, education of how many years he or she is going to school and how many years he or she is expected to if there's a discrepancy between these two numbers then the education is not up to the mark to measure the health health standard of the country we measure the life expectancy at birth which is how many approximate years a person is expected to live the better the higher the life expectancy the better the health uh, finally to measure the standard of living we measure the gross national in income per capita which is simply the national income of the country divided by its per capita divided by its total population all of the indicators that i mentioned are marked they are measured and an average is uh, an average is deduced and this average makes up the HDI score of a country and all the countries are marked uh, are ranked according to this HDI score. Uh, if we look at the latest report, Swiz uh, Switzerland comes out as the as the at the top at the first rank and the rank of India is 132nd. Uh, the, India slipped a rank. India had the 131st rank in 2021 and it has slipped from 131st to 132nd rank and uh, most of the indicators of India have dwindled which is not something to be surprised of. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, the HDI of the entire world has declined and all and more than 90% of the countries have seen a decline in their human development index score uh, which, uh, which again is due to many factors COVID-19 being one and furthermore the, a lot of geopolitical tussle going on in uh, today's world uh, which uh, some of them we obviously know about we know about the crisis in Afghanistan we know about the war in Ukraine but we do not know about many hidden wars such as one that is happening in Ethiopia right now and I bet that you did not know about it 
if you do want to uh, learn more about the ethiopian war uh, do let us know in the comment section and we'll make a video on it uh, talking specifically about india the indian score has the indian hdi score has gone down from 0.645 in 2021 to 0.634 in 2022 and uh, the scores of india in all the sec uh, indicators have dwindled uh, except of mean schooling the most the most suffered indicator is obviously the life expectancy which has gone down from 71.8 years to 67.2 years which is due to the pandemic due to due to its impacts and which is uh, which which has suffered globally you should also know that the uh, UNDP comes out with four more indexes along with the human development index the human development is first the second is the human inequality inequality adjusted human development index uh, the gender development index the gender uh, inequality index and the multi dimensional poverty index it is it is it is good to know that india is doing well on the inequality index as per the report and that india is the and and that india is bridging the human development gap between men and women faster than the world as has been mentioned by this report but there are other reports which say otherwise such as the recent oxfam report on discrimination and the uh, and you can refer to the video i made on inequality furthermore india has also done very well in sustainable development uh, and so everything is not all doomed Uh, i hope you like this video if you did like this video do subscribe to our channel do press the bell icon and uh, do do so that you receive regular updates on whenever we upload a new video and do comment and tell us how did you like this video thank you so much